Welcome to your personal safety device, the SOS FOB from Lone Worker Solutions. SOS FOB is lightweight, compact, waterproof and dustproof, and the device is connected to our award-winning Safe Hub Lone Worker protection system. Safe Hub uses GPS to enable our alarm receiving center, or ARC, to locate you 24-7 in the event of an emergency. Because our system is BS8 484 Gold Certified, we can bypass normal 999 services, getting help to you in the fastest possible time. Using your SOS FOB regularly will make it much easier in an emergency. Don't worry about false alerts, the ARC operatives are there to support you. Switching SOS FOB on and off. Press the power button on the side of the device for three seconds to turn your SOS fob on. The device will vibrate and the LED lights will start flashing. Turn it on at the beginning of your work so it's ready in case you need it. To switch the SOS fob off, press and hold the power button and the SOS button together until you feel a vibration and hear an audible beep. Charging SOS fob. Insert the USB cable into the plug provided, then into a suitable power source and connect the other end of the cable to the charging cradle provided. Then place the fob into the cradle so that the gold contacts meet. You'll feel the device vibrate when it's correctly connected and the blue LED light will turn into a solid color. Your device can also be charged directly using the USB cable plugged into the side of the device. Make sure your device is properly charged at all times. Customized options. SOS FOB has three main features. This is how to use them. Feature one, red alert. If you feel at risk, the red alert function will open a two-way audio call with highly trained operatives at the ARC. They will have secure access to your personal escalation procedure and real-time GPS data. We provide SOS FOB with two sound options, audible mode and silent mode. Please check with your manager which option is enabled. To activate red alert, press and hold the prominent SOS button. In audible mode, you'll feel a vibration, hear a beep and hear the device dialing. In silent mode, you'll only feel a vibration. To end the call, press the SOS button again. The ARC can also end the call if you are happy for them to stand down. Red Alert can also be used to provide a virtual buddy. For example, if it's late at night and you're walking to your car, press the SOS button and when connected, just say virtual buddy and the ARC operative will stay on the call with you until you indicate that you're okay. Then just press the SOS button again to end the call. The initial seconds of every call are used for active listening in case you can't speak freely. The operatives are trained to make their own determination, assess your situation and escalating the call if they think you are at risk. Red alert calls are recorded and can be used in evidence in court proceedings, for example in the case of an assault. Feature 2 – Yellow Alert Yellow Alert lets you leave a message with task or location specific information. The message will be recorded along with your GPS location. If you then raise an alert or can't be contacted, the message will be accessed and can provide time-saving information about your movements. Make sure the details you leave are clear and specific, such as how long you expect a meeting or journey to take, or the floor number of an office you are visiting, or where you parked in a multi-storey car park. If you are leaving address information, please provide the full address, not just a postcode. To use yellow alert, press and hold the power button. In audible mode, you'll feel a vibration, hear a beep and hear the device dialing. In silent mode, you'll only feel a vibration. Once connected, you will hear an automated message. Leave your message after the tone. The message will be recorded for up to one minute. Please press the SOS button to end the message once you have finished speaking. Leave yellow alert messages regularly so they will be used as part of the internal escalation process, allowing responders to locate you quickly in an emergency. Feature 3 – Worker Down Worker Down uses motion and shock sensors built into the SOS FOB to raise an alert if the device detects an impact. If the device registers an impact with enough force, it enters a standby mode. It waits for 5 seconds 
and if there has been no movement in that time, then a 10 second countdown begins. During this time, the device will produce an audible beep every second. Sensitivity can be customised. To cancel a false alert, just press the SOS button during the 10 second countdown. If you don't cancel the countdown, the device automatically raises an alert with the ARC. An operative will call your device to make sure you are OK. If you don't answer, they will follow the next steps in the escalation procedure, such as contacting a line manager. In the event of a false alert, just advise the ARC operator to stand down. LED indicators. The device has two LED lights, which let you know that it is charged and connected to the GPS system. Green LED. Single rapid flash every three seconds means the device is connected to the GSM network. A double flash every three seconds means the device is registered to the GPRS network. No blue or green light means the GPS chip is sleeping. Blue LED. Blue LED on continuously means the device is charging. When fully charged, the light will go out. Blue LED blinking quickly means the battery power is less than 15%. Recharge it. Please refer to the manual supplied for a full breakdown of all functions. If you need support, email us at support at